Do you really love the real estate investing business? This is Rick Jarman, Real Estate Investing Old School. You know, I hear people say all the time, well, you know, I don't really love the business. It's just a means to the end of where I want to get to be financially. Folks, that's not me. I love this business. I love every aspect of it. It's been good to me. It's all I've ever wanted to do. It's what it's all I've done since I was 18 years old. At some point, different phases of it, but it's always been in the real estate housing industry. Well, you know, you can't do this business long term and not love it. You know, these folks that say, well, you know, they don't really like it. You're not gonna be able to. I find that hard to believe. I just, and I, I mean, each person knows itself what they like, but I don't buy it. <laughs> you, know, you know, and that may be the case. And quick as they make a little money, they may be out of it. But you know, I'm like this. You're going to be doing something. Unless you're so rich, you don't have to do anything. You're going to be doing something. And I don't know of a better industry than this industry right here. You know, I can't see staying in a long time if you don't like what you're doing because it, it can be hard. But speaking of this business, and I'm not a big rah-rah type person. I, you know, I want you to, you know, I believe you got to work hard. You got to work smart, but you got to work hard. You got to stay after it. You can't read books, stay home and think about it. At some point, you got to put it to action. But I think you need to learn, if this is the business you want to do, you need to learn as much about every phase of it as you can. You know, if you want to know about flipping houses, learn about flipping houses, but you need to be learning about holding property and learn more about the, you know, how that works and do as many things as you can in this business to make a living. And I always think like an investor. If you get your real estate license, still think like an investor. If you're going to wholesale a house, still think like an investor. You know, if you're going to flip houses, still be thinking like an investor because that long-term wealth is created by buying property and holding it. Now, you know, getting rich through real estate is not an overnight thing, folks. It's a time game. It takes a little while. Or getting wealthy, let me say getting wealthy. Rich is all and you know, how you want to break it down. I guess if we get up every day and we're healthy and we got a roof over our head and Food in our belly, we rich. So let's say getting wealthy in the real estate business, the rental property or whatever. Or let's say getting wealthy with uh, real estate investments. But anyway, all this was kind of on my mind today. I'd read something, I heard something, it, you know, gets me to thinking about things. And I said, well, you know, that might be something good to talk about because I do. I, every one time just about I hear one of these podcasts, people say, well, you know, I don't really like the real estate business. Uh, Invest in business. I'm just, I just do it for the money and, and uh, the means to the end. As I said, folks, not me. I love it. I love everything about it. I've loved it from the summer I worked in construction between 11th and 12th grade to this morning when I got up. And a lot of jobs you can't say that. So if you want to do this business, learn as much about everything you can. And of course, I think I said that, but we're going to. Say it again. And also, you know, I hear people say, what can I do to get started? You know, well, like we've talked about before, it's the same old answer to that question. If you don't have credit and you don't have any money, you've got to work with partners or somebody to finance things for you. And again, they're not gonna do that unless you've been learning stuff. So be learning, make yourself valuable. But anyway, that's what I was going to talk about today because that's what was on my mind. This is a good industry. Get involved in it any way, shape, and form you can and start learning all you can. Y'all have a good day and I'll talk with you tomorrow.